The Cincinnati Bengals are young. Youth is Greg Cook, the Bengals' 22-year-old rookie quarterback who can fake, pass, and run with the best. So much so that Coach Paul Brown says Cook will one day be another Otto Graham. Cook has, in two weeks, taken giant strides toward fulfilling that prophecy. Last week, he beat Miami. This week, he and his teammates upset the San Diego Chargers. John Hadel is the generation gap. Though not quite 30, Hadel was today fated to be the villain, the confident master against the green rookie, the square father against the hip kid with long hair. Today, the kid and his cohorts would strike another blow for you. The Chargers youth is epitomized by number 22, Dickie Post. Post gained a career high of 147 yards today. 60 of them on his cross field jaunt that set up a field goal. Post can run both inside and out, and today was one of only two bright spots in San Diego's offense. The other was number 27, Gary Garrison, the Chargers' flashy receiver, who set up one Charger touchdown with this spectacular catch. Brad Hubbard's two-yard run gave San Diego a 13-10 lead with a minute and a half left in the half. Greg Cook needed only 50 seconds to go 70 yards and regain the lead for Cincinnati, showing the poise that made him such a highly touted rookie. In the third quarter, the Chargers pressed hard on the youthful spine of the Bengal defense, but Paul Brown has, in little over a year, molded both a talented and confident defensive unit that has so far been able to make the big play when needed. On fourth down from the sixth, defender Ken Riley helped save a touchdown that was perhaps the key play of the game. Boys under pressure. This is the quality Greg Cook seems to possess. A poise that belies his age. He and receiver Bob Trumpy, number 84, put Cincinnati ahead by 11 on this 78-yard score. But alas, Cook was fallible. Youth got the best of him for one short-lived moment in the game, and it cost him dearly. It didn't take him long to rebound, however, and the 11-point lead was regained on this 61-yard pass and run to yet another first-year man, Bruce Kastler. It was now 31-20. In the final period, Hadel and Garrison combined for yardage, but not for touchdowns. The Bengals added a field goal to make it 34-20, and all that remained was to observe the Chargers' own version of the youth quake. Rookie quarterback Marty Domrin. Damra showed his stuff, but Greg Cook, the Bengals, and coach Paul Brown showed the pro football world that Cincinnati has come of age.